Hi, I'm Stephen Simon, co-founder of the Spiritual Cinema Circle, with a preview of the movies for volume one of 2010. I just may be the girl of your dreams, Joe. Don't mess this up. You're the boss. First up this month, we have an extraordinary feature called Counting Backwards, about a man who is facing an incredible challenge in his life, and just as he knows that he has to deal with it, he meets the woman of his dreams. Oh, no! The guy really loves a girl he either takes her to, rescues her from, or meets her at a balcony. It fits the theme of this month, which is stepping out of our comfort zone. We're very proud to have this film. The Spiritual Cinema Circle is the first real distributor of this movie. It's poignant, it's funny, it's loving, and it's human. This is so much better than the time you hit me with your car. <laughs> our shorts this month include three very different movies. That's magic. The whole world seems to say that's magic. If only they had brains, that's magic. That's Magic is about a magician who has really lost his faith. Tell him there's no such thing as magic. He doesn't really believe in what he's doing. He's just not himself today, that's all. Maybe next time, eh? It's also an extraordinary film about music, about hope, about life, and about what belief really is. What do you see? Only the wise really believe. We also have an extraordinary film called Paul and His Wall. This is a film about a young man who absolutely is terrified to go outside of his room, which is a metaphor for going outside of his own comfort zone, until through a hole in his apartment wall, he meets someone who gives him the courage to step up and start living his own life. I'm so oh. sorry. Oh. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to scare you. Um, my name's Bo. Hi, Bo. And lastly, but certainly not least, the Graffiti of Mr. Tupaya, a film from New Zealand, starring, by the way, the man that played the grandfather in Whale Rider, about a janitor in a school who comes across a very important secret and goes way outside of his comfort zone to help a young person who is desperately in need of someone who will step in and change her life. Those are the films in the Spiritual Cinema Circle for Volume 1, all about stepping outside of our own comfort zone. Thanks very much. I look forward to seeing you in the circle.